friends, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and I'm on the WW or the Weight Watchers Blue Plan. Happy Saturday, it's Saturday so it is grocery haul day. This week our haul is a little bit different. I did do Walmart grocery pickup and Trader Joe's but the grocery haul portion is a voiceover because we have construction happening in our house. We're getting new floors put in, so it's loud, like obnoxiously loud. So I went ahead and just did a voiceover, but I found some good stuff this week at both Walmart and Trader Joe's, and I'm excited to share it with you. So if you are here for another grocery haul, give this video a big thumbs up. And if you're new or you haven't yet subscribed, I'd love to have you hit the subscribe button and don't forget to ring the bell right next to it so you never miss a single video. Check out the description box down below for my brand new recipe ebook, 15 recipes ww points for all plans and calories and it's only fifteen dollars and it is stunning you guys are absolutely loving it which warms my heart you'll also find nutrition coaching i offer personalized to you macros and calories as well as one-on-one -on -one coaching if you'd like to chat with me directly links discounts to all my favorite things and my facebook group come on over join us there we'd love to have you are also down in that description box sorry for the sweaty mess i just got home from jazzercise but let's jump into this week's grocery haul. Welcome to this week's grocery haul, again from Walmart Grocery Pickup and Trader Joe's. Starting with this Wheat Montana flour, this was a substitution for the regular flour that I ordered. And of course, I had to pick up another pack of my mini French baguettes from Trader Joe's. We love, love, love these so much. I had to grab some tomato paste for a recipe as well as a can of tomato sauce and a can of black beans. These are all for my lunch meal prep that you'll be seeing on Monday. I I did pick up another container of Troy's favorite butter. He loves this butter so much, so I grabbed that. And then we are back on our cream cheese bagel kick, and so I picked up honey pecan cream cheese, a dozen eggs for Troy's egg salad sandwiches for his lunch, and I needed tortillas for a couple of recipes, and I love the extra thin. I also picked up these pumpkin cookies. These were actually a substitution. I ordered a different brand, and then they substituted me with two packs, so I'll take it. And then I needed one can of biscuits, which they didn't have. So I just picked up the four pack and no Trader Joe's trip goes without dog treats. I thought these were super cute. I also needed a big container of vegetable broth for a couple of recipes, a bag of Fritos for a dinner recipe that I'm really excited about, low fat buttermilk for a, a dinner recipe. And then this is new to me. These are the earth's best chicken nuggets for kids, for babies. They were really low in point. So I'm going to make a salad with those. This is the bagels that I chose just the plain for that honey pecan cream cheese. Troy asked for another big ham that he can take for lunches and munch on for snacks. This is the bread I chose for him for his egg salad sandwiches for the week. And then of course from Trader Joe's, I picked up a bag of his favorite yogurt covered pretzels. He loves these. We needed some meat this week. So I picked up some chicken breast along with some 99% ground turkey. And then this was in my order. I didn't order it. I didn't pay for it, but for some reason it was thrown in my order. So I put that into my freezer, some more cheese for Troy's meat, cheese and crackers, and then a couple of fun snacks at Trader Joe's. These biscottis are my favorite and I haven't had these five seed almond bars in so long. They are very, very good. I needed some more light mozzarella cheese as well as the Trader Joe's light shredded three cheese blend, and then some potato salad. This just caught my eye. I picked it up. Troy said it was absolutely delicious. He asked for grapes for the week, so I picked those up along with some raspberries and some organic blackberries for me for fruits for the week. Some green onions for a couple of dinner recipes and some salads, and I need a couple of navel oranges for a dinner recipe. I needed some more onions and some lemons for my water. So that is everything that I picked up for this week's grocery haul. Let's go ahead and jump into what I'm doing for dinners and of course what you'll be seeing on Monday for meal prep. So here is this week's menu. This is the last week of August moving into September. Today, Saturday, we are going out for dinner, frozen pizza. I'm not quite sure what we're going to do today, but it's our extra night out day. And then Sunday, I'm making orange chicken. You guys will see this recipe in Wednesdays, what I eat in a day, so stay tuned for that. Monday is going to be chicken fingers and fries per 
my husband's request. Tuesday is a leftover night. Wednesday, I'm doing meatball biscuit casserole. This is kind of like a bubble up recipe. Pretty excited for that. And then Thursday is Frito chili pie, also requested by my husband. And then Friday, we always try to eat up any leftovers from earlier in the week. Here's what you'll be seeing on Monday for meal prep. You're not going to want to miss this one. For breakfast this next week, I'm making sausage cheddar biscuits. These are like the red lobster cheddar biscuits with sausage and cheese, perfect for breakfast. Lunch is going to be black bean and cheese enchiladas. I've been craving Mexican food. And then dessert is lemon bars. We are going to have the last kind of summery fresh dessert before we move into fall. So don't forget to make sure you are subscribed and your bell is turned on so you are here for Monday's meal prep. Thank you for joining me on another weekly WW Grocery Haul. I hope you enjoyed seeing all the good stuff that I picked up. I hope it was okay to have a voiceover. Don't forget to check out the description box down below for my recipe ebook, nutrition coaching, links, discounts to all my favorite things, and my Facebook group. We'd love to have you join us over there. Thumbs up this video, of course, if you enjoyed it. And if you're not yet subscribed, what are you waiting for? Hit that little subscribe button. I'd love to have you. Happy Saturday, friends, and I'll see you all in tomorrow's video. Bye!